The aircraft possessed a valid certificate of airworthiness. The second one, the crew obtained the license and qualifications to conduct the flight. And third, the takeoff roll appeared very normal. And the fourth one is, the crew performed all the procedures repeatedly provided by the manufacturer, but was not able to control the aircraft. Initial information gathered during the course of investigation, two safety recommendations has been forwarded in the preliminary report. The first one is, since repetitive uncommanded aircraft nose down conditions are noticed in this preliminary investigation, it is recommended that the aircraft flight control system related to the flight controllability shall be reviewed by the manufacturer. And the second one is, aviation authorities shall verify that the review of the aircraft flight control system related to flight controllability has been adequately addressed by the manufacturer before release of the aircraft to operations. <laughs>